Serpent-like monsters are constant across mythologies around the globe. And this one is up there with the most terrifying. A creature so large and so powerful that it's capable of swallowing not just the Earth, but all of creation as we know it, but doesn't due to its one and only fear. There's a lot not known or written about this entity, but join me please as we take a quick trip to the Middle East. Hello, I am Adam, and welcome to Pantheon Mythology. Today, we'll be looking at Falak, the huge serpent that lives below a giant fish who carries the earth on its back. Only in mythology, eh? Many will be aware of the likes of Jormungandr, the Linnaean Hydra, and the Basilisk, as they are all well-known, widely represented serpents when it comes to mythology and folklore. A-listers, if you will. Falak, however, while lesser known, is arguably the deadliest of them all. Arabian mythology tells us that the support system of the Earth is a giant fish known as Bahamut. Below this fish, we travel down through the six levels of Hell, where in the seventh level, it is said you'll bear witness to Falak, a snake-like creature that, as mentioned earlier, has the capacity to devour everything in existence, but doesn't, due to its fear of God, or in this case, Allah, the only thing more powerful than the beast itself. Present from the beginning of time, Falak, whose name means star in Arabic, is said to be on standby, ready to reveal itself come the end of days, ready to devour the sinners that walk amongst us. So, much like Santa Claus here in the West, Keep your name off that naughty list. Other versions of the legend tell how there are an entire species of Falak that live upon the earth and, while still incredibly dangerous, tend to stay within the tunnels they dig beneath the surface. These Falak are smaller in size in comparison to the wannabe devourer of everything, although have the ability to grow if fed enough food and water. So, if you ever see a fiery red snake, don't go giving it your leftovers. Falak, like many creatures from Arabian folklore, has been referenced in the book 1001 Nights, which highlights many of the wondrous creatures from the Middle East. What are your thoughts on Falak then? Were you aware of it before watching today? And how do you think it compares to other mythological serpents? Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And subscribe if you're new here as we release new content every week. Why not also check out our Falak-inspired t-shirt on Pantheon Apparel. Our clothing features designs based on deities, monsters and legends from across the Pantheons. We're rated excellent on Trustpilot and ship worldwide. You'll find a link in the description below. If you've made it this far, click on this video right here and learn about the giant fish Bahamut, who resides above Falak and supports the Earth. Thank you for tuning in, and as always, see you on the next one.